Hey, this is Matt Whitmer from Ready Precision. As you can see by the title of this video, a big announcement was made by Tritium about two weeks ago. I wanted to get uh, some confirmations uh, from the folks at Tritium before I made this video because I think it's such an, Im an important topic. It affects pretty much everyone in the community. Um, and that is that the JS8000 end of life schedule has been released. We have a date. Um, we have dates plural, um, of all of the different parts of the end of life for the 8,000, uh, software and hardware, and when the last time you'll be able to buy um, is. So let's take a walk through that schedule and um, think about what it means for us. All right, so the first part of this end of life schedule is going to be Q3 of this year. That's when the last version of Niagara that's going to have support for the 8000 will be released. This is going to be a long-term support release, um, bumping out the current long-term support release, which is 4.10. What that means is that uh, because it's a long-term support or an LTS, it will get at least two and a half years of support by Tritium. So that means bug fixes, patches, that kind of things for at least two and a half years. And uh, the current LTS, 4.10, will have been um, supported for nearly three years by the time 4.15 comes out. So uh, just something to uh, keep in mind, and, you know, don't sweat. Uh, Tritium does support these LTS uh, software uh, products uh, very well. So the next step in that schedule is going to be December of uh, 2025. So uh, nearly a year and a half later, um, and that's going to be our last chance to buy any 8,000 hardware. Um, that obviously is going to be subject to availability, that Tritium still has them in stock, um, and your distributor, Brody Precision, hopefully, um, has them in stock as well. Uh, but that will be your last chance to buy. And then the last Part of the schedule is the complete end of support for the hardware will be in July 2028. So you have plenty of time to figure out um, what you want to do going forward. Obviously, you're probably your best bet. Your direct replacement is going to be the 9000. Uh, you'll see a lot more content about the 9000 here um, in 2024 from us at Birdie Precision. Um, we really like the product, and, and we think that it's a very good product or a good upgrade from the 8000. Very capable. Um but good to keep all of these things in mind. You have plenty of time to um, upgrade your software. Uh, make sure you have stock for yourself for projects going forward. Um, and uh, I think Tritium did a good job of making sure that we're all aware of this well ahead of time um, so that we don't run into any issues. So, uh, as always, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions, and um, I can do my best to answer those as they come in. And uh, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.